Hello guys, it's me, Vyarkas XD, and today we're going to be doing an uh, automatic, automatic kind of, of melon farm, and I'm going to be showing you how it works and what you have to do, and it's going to be really quick, it's under um, under one minute, and it's the quickest thing ever, so now I'm showing you what, it's, what the model will look like, what it's going to look like, so it looks simple, it looks fast, and you only need a limited amount of resources, so it ain't going to be like head, redstone, headstone ready, redstone heavy, so all you gotta do is basically plant the melon on the left and it'll grow and the melon will pop out and go down the water flow to go into your path where you just drop down and get the melons. As you can see there's two fence fence gates there and the only reason why I have them there is because sometimes the melons block so you know it's just there to, so you can get the melons just in case if they block. So I'm going to show you how to do this thing. It only takes a few like 30 seconds more than like 40 seconds and you'll see a timer on the top right as soon as I start building it and I'm telling you now it's really really quick, really effective and you know it's just some decoration just in case so I'll see in the next clip where you'll see how to do it ok I am back so as you can see you need a sticky piston, a piston, a diamond hole, some melons, some boat, a pressure plate, fence and a fence gate so the stop wash has started so you need 5 that way, 5 horizontal you need another 5 horizontal, get your diamond hole, you need to hold it to the left, hold the right one as well, but obviously the wrong way. Get your melon seeds, but unfortunately I messed up and didn't have any melon seeds. And obviously you're going to plant the melon seeds because you know, that's what you're supposed to do. So you plant the melon seeds left, plant it right, and you get you get some pistons, two pistons, one there, one there, just copy me. And for the sticky piston, do not copy me here, I just completely messed up here. I didn't know what I was doing, so I would just wait for me to un mess up. Okay, nearly there. That's that's wrong, Chris. No, that is wrong. Sorry. Okay, now you put the sticky piston up like that. Then you jump and put a dirt block. Then put a dirt, a dirt block behind it. Then put the pressure plate uh, on top of that dirt block and add a bolt perfectly. If the bolt is not adjusted perfectly like that, then you're gonna have to try again because the bolt adds the pressure pad, which makes it automatic. So as you can see, I'm gonna get the melon. I'm gonna put it down, and, as the, and there you go. Whoa, that's basically it. How many seconds did it take for me? 38 seconds, something like that. 38 seconds to build an automatic farm. It's really just amazing how fast it does it. And look at it, it's automatic, it's completely automatic. The only thing you have to do is like pick up the melons yourself, which is, you know, it isn't, it's okay, it's only picking up melons. So there you go. So now I'm going to show you how to decorate it or add, uh, for example, add fences and stuff. So what you need to do is uh, uh, um, dig up five. And then you gotta add a water source left and right, as you can see here. Let me get the water source out. Get your bucket of water, put one to the right in the right corner, put one in the left corner, and there should be a middle block that ain't moving. Then you dig down directly like that. Just copy what I do in the video, it's really simple. That's all you really have to do. You don't have to listen to me, because you know sometimes I will mess up. And you can make this lot you can make this water flow as long as you want. I'll just make it one block, maybe two. And I'll put the fence gates around it. You put one there, one there, one there, just like cover it around like this, like so and then you simply add the fence gates here yeah and then do the same thing from behind with the gate with the fence no. <coughs> sorry and add number two fence gates like that so you can collect the mist leading melons and there you go guys so you just add a fence gate in the middle here so you know you can just close it just for so just so no mobs or anything you can like enter the, the water flow and that's simply as you can see I'm putting the melons will grow they'll just burst and you'll simply be able to collect it like so. So, I'm guessing that's it guys. Thanks for watching my redstone tutorial with pistons and sticky pins, pistons. And I hope you give it a like, because likes, you know, they give me the motivation to keep doing things like these. And this makes me want to keep going. So thanks for watching guys. It's been me, Rayakas XD. And, you know, I love you all. Goodbye.